this is my ninja 400 and i'm having some issues with my front brake lever see how soft it is so one track day ago i changed the brake fluid and i just recently changed the brake pads very soft for my liking I bled the brake lines as much as possible there were no bubble coming I'm gonna leave my brake lever zip tied for whole night and see if it's get better update I just zip tied my front brake lever and we'll leave it tonight like this and we'll come back in the morning and see how it goes just cut the cable tie off and my brake lever is still not the way I really want it to be so that means I need to do some more research and see what's need to be done wow Oh my god, this feels so better now. Can't wait to try it out on the track. Yay. Alright, upgrade on my Subos front brake rotor for Ninja 400. Uh, this thing didn't last even four sessions on track. Yeah, I believe, look at the color. A little disappointing. I was expecting a lot from this. Yeah, one more thing which I want to discuss about the bolts. You need to order different bolt size because you won't be able to use your OEM Ninja 400 uh, rotor bolts on this one because they won't fit. The holes in this one are not big enough to use your OEM bolts. Plus, look at the discoloration on the disc. And didn't use it for whole track day, I couldn't. It's already been warped. And didn't do any heartbreaking, nothing. Even after the first session, it was looking weird straight away. And I was like, this is no good at all. Uh, anyway, just a couple of emails, I got my money back which was great and I end up buying Metal Gear front rotor and I'll be using that one tomorrow on my 400 at track day and I'll see how it goes.